name is Alexandra Kechner. I'm one of the head and neck surgical oncology microvascular surgeons here at UK. I primarily work with head and neck cancer patients. So that's any cancer basically from the bottom of the brain to the top of the lungs. Part of my specialty involves transoral robotic surgery. So patients who have tumors of the tonsils or the tongue base, as well as well, what's called microvascular reconstruction. So what that involves is when someone has a large operation for a cancer in the head or neck area, in order to reconstruct those, we actually use tissue from another part of the body, almost like a transplant. So we take an artery and a vein as well as that tissue and then reconnect it to an artery and a vein in the neck. I will see people for at least five years. So unless they move away or they pass away, I will see them for a full five years. And so they're, they're family. Once they come in the door, um, even if they decide that they want to get treatment somewhere else, I still will try and check in on them every now and again if possible. Um, because we want to just make sure that, you know, if something would happen to them and they need to come in, we know what's going on with them. The head and neck area are really integral in speech, breathing, and eating. And until you can't eat in public or eat with family, you don't realize how much of a social aspect of life that that is. And so that's one of our biggest focuses is that when a person comes in with a tongue cancer or throat cancer, the first thing we look at is, okay, what is our cancer plan, but then what is our long-term function plan as well? Mm -hmm.